Israel's Mossad agency has struck on Malaysian soil again. This Monday, Malaysia's New Straight Times revealed Mossad agents recruited and used Malaysian local operatives to hunt down and abduct two high-value Palestinian men they believe to be assets of the Hamas Al-Qasim Brigade. In a brazen snatching grab operation in the heart of Kuala Lumpur, the team intercepted the two Palestinian high-value targets just after 10 p.m. on September the 28th, when the duo, both computer programming experts, were about to enter their vehicle after having dinner at a nearby mall. The covert operation, however, swiftly went south as police swung into action and raided their safe house in Hululangat, all within 24 hours. They rescued the victim in the midst of being interrogated by two Israeli men via a video call. He had been beaten up and tortured by his Malaysian captors. The traumatized Palestinians have since left Malaysia. The victim sustained injuries to his body, head and legs. The Mossad network in Malaysia is understood to be headed by a local woman in her mid-30s. The newspaper also revealed that the woman was trained as a private investigator before being recruited by a Mossad agent. The Malaysian woman was subsequently sent for training abroad, including in Europe, to master the art of espionage. She is believed to have set up a surveillance team to trail the two Palestinians and was on the Israelis' retainer for 2,000 euros a month and is said to have several local men working for her. And in the latest developments, sources have revealed that Mossad had its sights set on at least six Palestinians living in Malaysia. Several of them are members of academia at local universities lecturing in professional disciplines including engineering. In one of Israel's propaganda sites, an icon of the Malaysian flag leads to a list of supposed targets. It is clear to these Palestinians Palestinians that they were on Mossad's radar and that their abduction or killing could just be a matter of time. Their complete profiles contained recent photos of these men carrying out their daily routines and pictures of their vehicle were also uploaded as a subtle message. Israeli intelligence agents are suspected to have carried out at least a dozen such operations since 2010, including two in Malaysia. Yakut Tobias for CIA Radio News.